Christ. Roosty time, boys. Rise and shine. What? Heard a knock in Franklin. Thought I did, Griff. Let's go, Pledge. Down it. Oh, man. Now, Stewie. Time's ticking, Pledge. <laughs> chug, 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 chug. <laughs> Not bad. Cut two seconds up last week. <laughs> Good boy, Stewie. You're a mess. Hey, Griff, there's no hamburger meat in the freezer. Buchanan's throwing a fit. Hey, tell Buchanan he's a fucking HMO. I'll do that, Doogie. Tell Buchanan hamburger meat has to defrost. Refrigerator, second shelf. Your pledge bros are waiting out front, Stu. Uh, no, no, no. You shower later. <laughs> it's a good idea to cover up, bud. Kickoff's in T-180, boys. Don't be late. Let's hit it, John. Hey, what are you doing up there, Griffith? Jerking off? <laughs> Some of us don't have to, uh, jerk off anymore, McDougal. Ooh, guess not. You have a late night there, uh, Griffith? Yeah, hoser, big guy. Hey, maybe you should try it sometime, dude. Oh, no, no, because then we'd have to sell our stock of petroleum jelly. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> you really think I'd use that stuff? Oh, what do you use, dude? Wouldn't you like to know? You didn't tell me you had a date last night. I forgot about it. forgot about it. Who was she? What happened? Hey, Griff, I thought you picked up an extra keg yesterday. Cooler downstairs. You don't know her. <laughs> How's Heather? Fine. I had to have dinner with the folks last night. Dinner with the folks? Hey guys, Bentley's having dinner with her folks. Whoa. Dinner with the folks. You must be getting pretty desperate. At least must be getting tighter. And that's why you're limping with that ball and chain. 
Hey, he looks like a moon up, doesn't he? <laughs> yeah, 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 guys. You got your doggy bags, okay? So what house is she in? Who? Your date. Well, um... House? Bill House? Griff, what time the chicks expect us? Eleven. And then we mix with the pies and the fans. Kappas. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Hey, hey, what's up? Hey, Bob, don't forget the speakers this time. Yeah, yeah I'm on that, Griff. I'm on that. So, did you get a little something-something last night? Plenty. One, two, three. Yeah. See so you found the meat, Buchanan. For cats, Griffith. For cats. I don't know about you, but I like my meat well done, Mr. Social Uh, don't you mean well hung, Buchanan? <laughs> my ass. Hey, check this out, Gary. Damn. The charcoal. I forgot the charcoal. Don't forget the charcoal. No problem. We'll just pick some up on the way. Come on, I told Pete we'd give him a ride. Where is that little fucker? Pete? Yeah, remember Pete? Hey, Bentley! Be cool. sure to remind Mr. Bradley that he still owes me his house dues. Just because he moved out of the house doesn't mean he gets to be cool for free. Hey, yo, Bradley! Today already! All right, already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up with you? Late night. Ah, you too, huh? Yeah. So let's hear it. What happened? And please, tell me a little more details on this guy. Hey, what do you care? You can get it whenever you want. Hey, Heather is not that easy. Proceed. What do you want to know? Who was she? Uh, she... She was excellent. <laughs> no way. <laughs> yeah. Save it, you guys. Hey, just drive, Griffith. Yeah? Fucking junior high. No way. No way. No way. Hey, no out, dude. Okay, seeing as it's going to be a high octane intake day, we'll make do with the generally accepted generic brands. What he means to say is it's too cheap to buy the good stuff. Still have a piece of yet, dude? Suck. Oh my god, it's not a dick. <laughs> Why do they call them kamikazes? One second, you're flying high. The next, you crash and burn. <laughs> Done, boys. That's because you're in the well done section, Gary. Over here, we got the fair to middle ins. Down here, the dogs. And over here, the under or commonly referred to as rare burgers. So, in other words, beat it. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see you two have it under control. Oh, we're all over it. <laughs> So, how'd I do? Mom, thanks for the second coming. And Dad, well, Dad remembered your name. So, is that good? Trust me, that's good. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> 
you gonna flip that one? Wainsey, how's life with the suits? Oh man, don't do it. Don't graduate, man. I don't think that's anything Griffith has to worry about. Uh -huh. <laughs> It's be tough making 80 grand a year, Wainsy. 85. With benefits. Fuck. Yeah! Hey, Wainsy, does that benefit package happen to include the boss's daughter? Oh, that's a low blow, Gary. Just give him shit! Gretchen, how have you been? I've been meaning to call you. You have? Absolutely. You want one here? Yeah, sure. Thanks. Last week we left off discussing the visualization of racial issues in the mass media and its impact on shaping our opinions today. I hate fucking you that first chapter four, as you were supposed I can't believe I this. We annihilate Washington on Saturday, and they're still ranked in the top ten. And of course I know that some of you in this class did take the time to go to the library and check out the news that I put on reserve for you today. Hey, don't worry about it. Just read and summarize. Did you see this? And the minorities. It totally you can find sucks. That it was in the ranking system needs to be with the that you Boys, mind analyzing the sports page on your own time. Don't apologize, Griff. We'll discuss what we want, when we want. Excuse me, I thought we were here to get an education. Oh, I got my education. I got my education. Excuse <laughs> me. <laughs> well, I do declare we done got ourselves a live one, huh? Nice one, Dookie. Hey, drop it, dude. Hey, big guy. Let it go. Excuse me. Is there something you all would like to add? I see. Well, now remember, your detailed outlines are due tomorrow and... I will be wanting to go over them with you one-on-one, -on -one, so please be sure that you sign up for a conference after class. Like, how long this outline been due tomorrow? Like, since the beginning of the semester, dude. Damn, must have spaced it. Yeah, you and me both. Come on, let's get back to the house. Well, for their sake, they're taking a pass-fail. Can't, it's not offered. Guess they're good for one thing, then. What? The curve? <laughs> <laughs> It's not that bad, John. You can look at my paper from last semester if you want. Okay. What the fuck are you doing, McDougal? This is Kate, Griff. Just grab a bunch of books that sound applicable. Steal a little bit from the table of contents, we'll shit the rest. Great. Hey, Griff. 
Gretch, hey, how you doing? Fine. How's it going? I'm swamped. I have a comm outline due tomorrow. Oh, no problem. I, I just wanted to tell you that I had a good time at the game last night. Yeah? Me too. Hey, we're having a kickoff party for a Rush Saturday. Why don't you come by? Are you sure? Absolutely. Okay, great. Cool. Wait, what, what about this? Stop it. Stop it. Or stop it, didn't you understand? What the fuck? Sorry. Uh -huh. Hey, Bradley. Hey. Yo, Griff. Hey, how you doing? What's going on? Hey. What's your problem? You're my problem, Griffith. At least you could have said it's good morning. Had a good time, gotta go. I didn't want to wake you. Bullshit. You know how I feel about spending the night. We'll call someone else the next time you get home. Hey, where you going, huh? Where you going? No. Come on, Pete. What do you want from me? What do I want? I want to wake up next to you, read the paper, have breakfast, you know, maybe even go out on a date. A date? Yeah, a date. Pick me up, dinner, a movie, whatever it is you do with Buffy and Muffy. Are you crazy? See you around, Griffin. Whoa, 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 whoa. What did I say? Go home and jerk off, John. Man, did I think you were someone else. John, come on! Give my backpack back. This is real cute. Come on, John, throw it down. Stop being such a pussy and get your ass up here. I don't fucking believe this. Okay, now here I am. I climbed the tree. I hand it over. What's this thing with Gretchen? What thing? Griff. Hey, what are you doing Sunday? A bunch of us are gonna go up mountain biking. What do you say? A bunch of us? Yeah, Todd, Duke, Scotty, Boz. It'll be cool, like old times. What do you say? No, thanks. Oh. I gotta go. What are you doing tomorrow night? 
Why? I don't know. Maybe we can hang. Maybe we could talk. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, it could be free tomorrow night. <laughs> Nine o'clock. Don't blow it, big guy. Oh, yeah, I got something else that belongs to you, too. Better hurry up and uh, get back to the bros before they start missing you. So what's up with Heather? What do you mean? Seems like you're doing the family thing and all. Yeah? So what's that mean? I don't know. Is it supposed to mean something? No, but it's kind of scary. Never had dinner like that with, with the folks, you know? Nope. Nope. It, it felt good, too. I don't know. It's, it's hard to describe. It's, it's like she's always with me. She is always with you. No, okay? Like, when I look in the mirror, I don't see, I don't see me. I don't, I don't see Todd. I see how Heather sees me. It's weird. I, I see Heather's boyfriend. And it's like I'm connected in this way that I've never felt before. Sounds like you're whipped. Maybe. Because <laughs> I know all I can think about in the morning is being with her. Her body, her, her hair, her scent. It drives me crazy. Yeah. So, uh, that's where all the Vaseline's been going. Here I've been pinning it on old Duke. No. Never use the stuff. Why, use the stuff? Yeah. I, I mean, no. No, no. <laughs> Listen, buddy, don't worry, okay? Because when you least expect it, some girl is going to come by and she's going to sweep you off your feet. Right. Guaranteed. So, you want to grab some dinner? I can. Come on. No, really, I have that outline to write. All right. What are you doing? What's it look like, asshole? I'm getting dressed. Okay. <laughs> hey, Griff. What time are we going? Ten minutes ago. Come on, what's the matter with you? Later, Griff. Strike pose. <laughs> Fuck you, Duke. Damn it, Pete.
Is there a biscotti in back? Uh, yeah, maybe so. Okay. Hi, is there somewhere I can post one of these? Yeah, right over there is fine. You know, you really should get a bulletin board. Good idea, thanks. Hey, how's it going? Hey, how are you? Mm. Uh, okay, got this one here. Yeah. Oh, better one. Double or seven? I think you'd show. Yeah, I should. Well, let's get out of here. Seven. Hey. Who's that? This place gives me the creeps. Let's get out of here. We just got here. I'm hungry. You have food? Real food. Come on, it's on me. Oh, so this is a date? Whatever you want to call it. What do you want to call it? I don't care what we fucking call it. Griff, I'm tired of this bullshit. You said you wanted to discuss things. That's why I came down here. Okay. Okay, that's right. Let's talk. Um, that's, that's right. You you want me to be different. No, I don't. Yes, you do. You do, too. You want me to be someone else. Chris. No, but I'm not. I am not someone else. I know that. No, no, hold on. I'm talking, all right? Jeez. See, I don't get any of this. I don't get it, okay? When I look in the mirror, I don't see this. I see me. What? I don't see you. So? So it, it's like, to me, you and... It's only a small part. It's just a tiny bit of the whole. This is not about sex, Griff. Isn't it? You're kidding me. What, what is it you think we've been doing? Wait, are you getting in our rocks off? Yeah, why not? What's wrong with that? I mean, come on, it's not like you have a problem with it. I mean, you do have a lot of new friends here, Pete. You're jealous. I can't believe it, you're jealous, I am. But don't flatter yourself, Bradley, okay? I just hope I don't have anything to worry about. What is that supposed to mean? You tell me. About? Is there anything I need to worry about? Well, well, rewind. And eject. I'm out of here. Here, join the community action patrol. Join the community action patrol. Here, here, join the community action patrol. Here, here join the community action patrol. Here, join the community action patrol. John. John! You're being such a baby. It all could have worked out, you know? Nothing had to change. Everything was fine until you up and moved out of the house. Oh, John, why don't you grow up? Oh, so now you're an adult. I'm a hell of a lot more of an adult than you are. Why don't you be a man? Oh, I know who I am. Oh, do you? Look at you, you're just nothing but a big fat liar. Your whole life's a goddamn lie. I'm tired of waiting around for you to figure that out. Oh, yeah? Well, fuck you. Fuck you, Bradley. Maybe I'm not like you. Maybe I'm not.
This is a very serious matter, one for which you need to take responsibility. What are you going to do about it, Mr. Griffith? You're absolutely right, Professor. This is really out of character for me. I'll have a rewritten outline for you by Friday. Typed. Typed. Next. Bunch of homos going nuts. Did you hear about the survey of fags they did? 40% of them said they were born gay, the other 60 said they were sucked into it. <laughs> Griff, what's up? Where were you last night? Yeah, I know. Where? Library. I checked the stacks, you weren't there. What's his problem? He's hung over, asshole. Isn't it obvious? Yeah, so why don't you take better care of your pledges, dude? Hello, Griff. Hello, anyone in there? The victim in his early 20s hey, is unconscious isn't that Pete? and listed no in way. critical condition at County Memorial Hospital. Doctors aren't sure if he will survive. Sheriff's deputies have little to go on and urge anyone with any information regarding last night's attack to call the Sheriff's Department oh, full free at 1-800-WITNESS. This is Ben Davis reporting live for WLB. County Memorial Hospital, please hold on a moment. No, we are not immediate family. Look, I'm sorry, I'm not authorized. Well, then you give me somebody who is authorized. Have a seat. This is unfucking believable. Are you friends of Peter Bradley? Yes. How is he? Uh, he sustained a serious blow to the cranium. And still unconscious. We'll know more after surgery. Surgery? Uh, yes. Now you'll have to excuse me. Detective Horn. Detective? Hello. She just has a few questions. What's going on? I understand this is a difficult time, but I just need some background information. Sure. When was the last time you saw Peter? In the library, night before last. Did he owe anyone money, gambling, drugs? Pete? No way. Do you have any idea what he was doing in that neighborhood? Uh, um... Like I said, he could have been there for like a million different reasons. No. Okay. If anything comes to mind, don't hesitate to call. You gonna catch whoever did this? We're gonna canvas the area and hopefully get a description of a vehicle or a possible assailant. We'll do our best.
Griffith Logan? No. Everything okay? Not really. Searching for myself. Sorry to hear about your friend. Your friend. Like a ship out on the ocean. Hey. I lost you. Uh, Hi, have you signed the petition for a city-funded street patrol? I don't live here. It doesn't matter, just sign and print your name. Yeah, right. Everything okay, Griff? Yeah. Can't just bail out like that. I didn't bail out. What do you call it? Griff, we were really worried about you. Okay, okay, okay. Buchanan's called the special house meeting. Good. Why don't we all go grab some food? I, I can't. I have to get to class.
low, but I was running a little late. Cool place you go there often. What the hell are you doing? Get your hands off me! I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry. Was it when I saw you at the library and got dashed? Yeah. Listen, can we um, grab some coffee? What? No, no. I mean, I, I mean, I can't. I have class. Later. Tonight? I'll pick you up. Washington. You kind of caught me off guard this morning. Huh? It was a surprise, that's all. What was a surprise? Running into you. You didn't just run into me. Well. What? You want to get some coffee? I do want to be here, but... Oh, boy, that man is dangerous. Do? It's harmless. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah. Was he a good friend? Yeah. How's he doing? I don't know. You don't know? Yeah, right. I don't know. I can't do this. Face his parents? How long have you two been? Look, we're close friends. I mean, nobody has a clue about this. And you want to keep it that way? I don't know. How do you do this whole thing? Uh, I have no idea. Huh? You and me, we're the same. We're in the same boat. <laughs> but this morning... So? I mean, no one knows no. that... No. No, they don't. I think I can relate. Yeah. <laughs> well, it must be nice to have some... Huh? It must be nice to have a close friend, I mean. Right. Now, if I had a friend who was in the hospital, I think I'd want to go see her. Yeah. I do. Okay, guys. Nationals put this in our hands. Now, I've talked to the detective investigating this case. What? And she might want to talk to some of you guys. She? Yeah, she. This is a criminal investigation. The idea is damage control, guys. Why? Because he was a fag? So what do we do? Send flowers? <laughs> Under the circumstances, we probably should. <laughs> Shut up, Scooter. Do I have to remind you guys that Rush starts on Saturday? Fucking E's and K's will have a field day with this one. What's the big deal? It's not like he lives at the house anymore. Moved out. Adios. Goodbye. Well, that's one angle. We can totally distance ourselves. Pretend like it never happened. Wait a minute, guys. We can't just ignore this. He's a fag, Bentley. How do you know, Joey? Did you fuck him? Well, the guy was in an alley behind a homo bar. 
Sorry. Mrs. Bradley. Yes? I'm John Griffith. Who? John Griffith. Griff. Oh, of course I didn't recognize you. I'm really sorry. Oh, I it is so good to see you. How's he doing? He's gonna pull through. I know he is. He's strong, you know. Really. I remember... Man. I just know. When things get hairy, Pete's always been there. Pete's the man. He talks about you a lot, too. Honey? Bill, uh, this is John Griffith, you remember? Oh, yeah. Hello. Hello, sir. Griff, right? Right. Any news? Nothing. They don't seem to be able to find anybody that's seen anything. Uh, Griff, would you like some breakfast? Breakfast? Yeah. Uh, listen, I gotta take off. Okay. I'm sure Pete would be happy you came. But the guys at the house are really pulling for him. This is Denitra. She's in our comm class. Hi, pleasure. Pleasure's all mine. You want to sit down? Oh, no, no, I couldn't. I'm sure you understand. I got a lot of studying to do. Fuck. This doesn't get any better, does it? I was with Pete the night he got attacked. What? I was with him the night he was attacked. Why didn't I follow it? Why didn't I go down to see? Follow what? Just to see, just to make sure. Follow what? The truck! You saw it? I I've run over a million times in my head. You gotta believe me. We met to talk. We had a fight. Walked me in my Jeep. That's it. Right. You know what? I totally forgot. I'm supposed to be meeting people right now. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. Wait! Dimitra! Who's that?
I'm John Griffith. I'm a friend I don't of. Know who you are. Come in. Can I get you anything? Some tea? Some toast? No, really. I can't stay. Come on, sit down. Oh God, my dissertation. I'm going crazy. My advisor is a total prick. Really? Yes. Really. Theories of economic distribution in a global economy. Wow. Yeah, wow. Except the only problem is, not much distribution going on. Same old story. Hmm? Rich get richer. Exactly. So, um, how are you holding up? Me? Fine. You friends with Pete? Well, we share a house. But, um, yeah, we talk a lot. Never thought anything like this would happen. Of course you didn't. If it's okay, I, I thought I'd get some of his stuff to take to the hospital so that when... That's a great idea. You know, um, he really cares about you. A lot. Take as long as you want. Oh, I'm glad to see you. 
Well, gee, Todd, nice to see you, too. Hey, thanks for helping me out, buddy. Sorry I've been such an asshole lately. Fuck you, Bentley. No, fuck you, John. Fuck you. What's wrong with you, huh? What the fuck is wrong with you, man? I've been busting my butt covering your ass. Who asked you? Who asked me? Who asked me? You... Alcohol inventory's a little low, all right, buddy? Frat boys without any booze get a little scary. There's an extra keg in the cooler. Right, the cooler's locked. He's completely frozen. Who well, fucked with the thermostat? Brilliant. We're totally dry up there, boys. Yeah, we know, Gary. This is getting very uncool. Okay, Gary. Damn it! I completely forgot. I completely forgot. Relax, relax, okay? We'll just go to the store and we'll get a new one. It's all right, it's all right. You're fucking up, Griffith. Fuck you, Buchanan! Fuck hey, you! Hey, hey, cool it! No, I'll cool fucking it. kill you, cool yeah. it! I'll yeah. kill you! You can't get out of here! Now! Very uncool. Everybody! God damn it! Hey, hey, hey! It's okay. Alright? It's over. You can't shut me out like this, man. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Come on. on.
found these in the Jeep. It's amazing. It makes you feel so insignificant. It makes everything seem insignificant. How do you mean? It's as if all the noise down there is gone, leaving only the stuff that's real. Imagine if Heather was like right next to you. All you had to do was reach out your arm to touch her, but you couldn't. That would suck, wouldn't it? Yeah. Because you didn't know if she felt the same way about you, or if she did, there's some reason it wasn't okay. Like other people wouldn't like it. One day, after months, years, it's just another day, nothing special, just the two of you. For some reason, everyone's out of the house. person. You define gravity together. And all at once, everything is different. You like in love with him, dude? I. I've never been so sure of anything. You know, it's funny when I catch myself thinking about Heather. what it would be like if anything ever happened to her. I would do anything, anything I had to do, just to make sure I didn't lose her. That's good, Todd. That's really smart. I was such a shit to him. I was such a shit. So you left the coffee house and said goodbye at the car. Yes. Gee. Any reason why you watched him walk up the street? We had a fight. When did you see the truck? After I got in my Jeep. No license plate? It was too dark. Well, anything at all you can remember? Anything unusual or specific about the vehicle? Loud music. Coming from inside. That's it. Any more questions? What took you so long? Check it over inside.
said it was all right. What's your name is Griff and Todd. Uh, brought by some of his own stuff. Thought he might like it. Oh, thank you. These are his favorite. He wears them all the time. Oh. Good. That's, um, good to know. Say, Mrs. B, uh, saw a killer-looking coffee shop downstairs. You want to go check it out? Uh, yeah, um, thanks, Todd. Uh, I'd love that. Hey, remember when you took us out for dinner freshman year? Yeah, I do. You gotta do that again real soon. Same old, same old. Smitty? Griff, Griff, Smitty. How you doing? All right. I'll catch you guys later, right? and Stewie were with him that night. Don't you remember? Understand? Keep your mouth shut. Hey, where's Stewie? You leave Stewie out of this. What the hell's going on here? Yeah. Wait, what's it all about, Griff? If you tell him now, you can tell him later, Duke. Depends on how much motivation you need. Fuck you, Griffith. Yeah, nothing. I was with him that night, asshole. I saw the truck. Griff. I saw the fucking truck. I didn't know who it was. Shut the fuck up, Stewie! I swear. We thought it was just some fag. I didn't know. I swear, Griff, I didn't know. We were drunk. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what's going on here. 
But I am sure of one thing. Don't you ever Don't ever let my son down again. What about this? You can keep it. Kind of goes with the room. He's got the rebound. Down by two. No time left for three point range. It's good. I don't want you to go. I know. Nothing's gonna be the same. Hey, hey, hey. I wanna go with you. I gotta go this one alone, buddy. Yeah, I know. You just remember I'm still your best friend. Cause I'll fuck you up if you forget it. Deal. <laughs> Here, all right. Wait up. Hey, um. We were thinking of stopping by the hospital sometime. Yeah? Yeah, um, we were just wondering what you thought. The Bradleys would love it. Well, I mean, we thought maybe we could, you know, all go together or something. Yeah. Absolutely. Cool. Hey, I'll take care of yourself. You too. Some ice cakes in the cupboard. Uh, celery juice? No, thanks. Guess I should be going to the market. Doing? Fine. 
Look, I, I'm really sorry. I... I know. How you doing? Me? Okay. It's gonna take some time. He... We still don't know anything. Look, if there is anything I can do, I will. Thanks. Yeah, this is he. Okay. Uh, honey, um, I could uh, go for a cup of coffee. How about you? Nah, not really. Oh, of course you could. Is that little shop down in reception? Some of your stuff by. Your favorite. Those aren't my favorite. Guess they're my favorite. Looks like they have you wired for sound. <laughs> such an asshole.
This is Pete. Hi, Pete. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And this is Todd, I think you've met. Hey, nice this is you. Heather. Hi. Hi. Um, Griff. This is Loretta. Loretta, this is Griff. Nice Hi. to meet you, Loretta. Nice to meet you. Hey, Loretta, are you in my English class? Yeah. <laughs> okay, how's it going? Good. You guys know Junior, right? Yeah. So, you, you guys going to game? Yeah. 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 Well, you know, let's go. Yeah. Searching for myself in a sea of emotions, like a ship out on the ocean in a storm. I lost my way, and then you came into my life. As I 
I tried to find my 